Uh oh. Um. Yeah. Hi. This is awkward, isn't it? Um. Bye. Yep. Boop, boop, boop. Ooh, hello. I'm crazy. You don't want to know what we do to you. Uh. <laughs> a robber. How quaint. Now why don't you give me your money? Yeah. Cheers. Now run. Nom. Nom 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 nom. nom. Wow, talk about a stroke of luck. Right, this guy's having a wires. Hello. Criminal violation, eh? Such is life. Man, see, I should have just hunted these back alleys for people having wires. <laughs> Police are hunting for me. Dick. If I get out of here. Whoop -de -do, slip -de -do. If I can just casually walk. I'm um, just walking to my taxi. Where's my suicide button? Oh, Trant will do. Oh! Excuse me! Sorry! Oh, hello. Uh oh. Can't break to combat? What? Okay, plan B. Blee! Okay, the police are hunting. I'm not in combat anymore, right? I wonder how bored they get. Man, what's up with the teleporter dudes? Hello? Oh, I'm taxi man, really? You're not gonna let me leave? I'm right here, you know, you can't ignore me. I'm trying to talk to you. Fine, I shall sit here and stare at you awkwardly for a while. <sighs> there we go. Sweet. Two. Uh, away from here, please. Preferably to Giovanni Stronghold. Alright! I totally got away with a crime spree. It was a pretty good crime spree, to be honest. As far as crime sprees go, people are like, Yo, Halloween, do you see that crime spree? I was like, yes, yes I did. In fact, I was the crime spree. They're like, what? You were the crime spree? And instead of saying, like, and then Halloween was the crime spree, I'd be like, yeah, you know Snake from The Simpsons? Me. Yeah. Uh huh? Okay. Okay, so we want to sneak into the mansion. There is a few ways of doing this. Uh, we can kill our way in. We can uh, persuade our way in. Or we can get ourselves, you know. Um, there is another way of getting in. Like, you can distract the guards around the back by throwing stuff and then sneaking in. Hello. Yeah, what is it? Uh, is this a Giovanni mansion? Giovanni? Oh, yeah. Are you the family member, member of family? That's right, yeah, yeah, cheers. Is that right? Hell of a family to be born into your marriage, into your both. You have an intuition with me? No, I don't, sadly. Hey, don't worry about it. I'm sure they'll let you in. Just tell them, Izzy. Just tell them you. Just tell them you lost it. <laughs> I'm losing all the time. Uh huh. You're kind of drunk. Yeah. I'll do that. Yeah, cheers. Maria. Maria Rosaline. Uh huh. Cool. Maybe I'll see you inside, Maria. Yo, dude. Yes, what is it? Is your wife okay? She'll be fine after I get a pot of coffee in her. One pot? <laughs> Smack her around a bit. The adrenaline should do the trick. I don't know. Maybe you should take her home. Well, she did pretty much cause the last function to come to a screeching halt. That woman has the self control of a pubescent chimpanzee. You better hurry up, I think she's gonna puke. Oh man, on, oh. Maria, Wait, she's puking on. blood, dude. You should, don't take her home, take her to her hospital. Seriously, she, she's puking blood. Whoop. Oh, that's handy. I've got myself an invitation. This is my invitation song. It's like my shotgun song. Hello, look, check it out. I got an invitation. Have you got one? Uh uh, uh uh. Dancing on your car. Mm -hmm. You know, this is annoying most people, but you see, I'm Femi Zach, so it's fine. Yo, Igor, let me in. You have invitation. Uh, yes, here you are. Mm. Please have a wonderful time. Thanks, Igor. I'll, uh, <laughs> see you inside, I think. Cool, so, we sneak in. I said we, you can't literally just blow up your way in and be like, bitches, bring it, and just kill people left, right, and centre. The thing is, this place is a vampire stronghold. So, you know, people are kind of tough in here. 
Okay, there's also a few ways we can go about this. We can try and persuade our way in, talk to the different family members and whatnot, and go about that. Ooh, we can totally kill them and you have to play the game. <laughs> yeah, we can all do that. Or you can ask these um, obviously not vampire guys at all. Uh, what's going on in here? There's a bit of a thing going on. In. Uh, so we're not going to kill our way, and we're going to talk to talk to people. They each have their own deep, dark secrets, and you can kind of like find out what's going on. So let's save it quickly, because I always muff this up really badly, and I'm like, "Yo, bitch, what's going on?" She's like, "Hey, you don't talk to me." It's fine, jeez. Hello. Might as well be a costume party. Everyone's smiling. Pretending this isn't a pageant put on by the patriarch of this family. Fine. But this is a contest, and I came to win. Congratulations. Who are you? Yeah, I'm Maria. Please make your acquaintance. Hmm. Mira. Mira Giovanni. So what exactly do you mean by this contest? They gather us up here to decide just who the best and brightest of this generation is. The lucky few are given the real power in this family. But some of us need to win more than others. Oh, forget it. You wouldn't understand. Luckily, I understand. Actually, I'll spare uh -huh. no expense for a lock. I want to be in that circle of power. And I won't let blood get in the way. And of course, when your time comes, I'll pay back the favor. Cool. I'll see what I can dig up for you. <clears throat> so, we talk to this guy over here. I'm like, hey, how's it going? Fantastic party, huh? What? Oh, sure. Uh, nice place to have here, huh? You know Uncle Bruno. Hey, you okay? Family events. How many more of these do we have to attend before we're taken? Yeah, really. I know what you mean. But wait, yeah, really? Is, the is that that's the persuading one? She was like, yeah, really. This guy to be like hollow or something. Seriously. They're pitting us against our own flesh and blood for the privilege of joining the power click. All you hear is, what have you done? How much did you make? Who do you know? You can't tell anyone anything because they might use it against you. You mean if you found dirt on the others, you wouldn't use it? The heart says no. Businessman in me tells me to smear them into the ground. I guess I will. And I know they probably do the same. So obviously there'd be some gossip about other people, huh? Yeah. I guess I would. Really? Huh. Let's talk to him again, see if we can dig anything up. Something the matter. Family event Oh, right. They're pitting it. Uh huh. Yeah. The heart says Yeah. Wait, I want to talk, find, talk about you, huh? Uh, what's your problem? Nothing to be concerned about. Excuse me. Yeah. Okay, fine. This isn't going to work. What about hey this guy? There. Adam Dunser. I don't think we've met. You are? Uh, Maria. Maria, pleasure to meet you. What line of work are you in? Death. Um. <laughs> uh. I'm an importer exporter. Myself? I'm an investment banker. Uh -huh. Great business, a lot of potential. For example, I got the inside track on this company right now. And let me tell you, when this company goes public, everyone's going to wish they had a piece of it. Then why do you invest in it? Well, I know somebody at the company, and that's what they call insider trading. I could lose my job for that. All right, tell me more. Well, it's a biotech firm. You know they're working on growing replacement organs. Really fascinating technology. In a couple of years, I bet everyone will be going to them for parts. I figure an investment of fifty thousand dollars could be easily tripled in five years. Yeah, you have, have you had much experience in this? You take risks in this game. Sometimes you make a million. Sometimes you lose a million. The economy changes. It's had problems lately, but it's bound to rocket back any week now. Oh, the irony. You haven't been very successful lately, have you? Scotton? Most people here, they've got cash they don't know what to do with. And if one of us falls on hard times, don't you think, as family, they're obligated to help him out? Besides, I get the kiss tonight. Everyone will be investing in me. In fact, if I could ensure my place at the grown-ups table by, say, drawing some attention away from my financial shortcomings, I'd be guaranteed the kiss. Know any dirt about the others I could use? I can't pay you, but I got this watch and this ring. Wow, you're a dirtbag. That's cool. Cool, cool. That suits me. So I wonder if we can use that on this guy to sort of help us along a bit. There we go. 
Family Gossip? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. He's broke. Really? Adam always seemed like he had a good head on his shoulders. Might just as well be dead as broke in this family. I think I almost let him handle my investments. If you hear anything else, I'll let you know. That means I can... I wonder if I got his trust. Family event. Yeah. You're fitting as a game. The heart. Yeah. Okay, obviously not. Uh, let's tell her. Oh. Hi, hi, uh... Yes? Uh, oh, nothing you could use. Okay. And then you can talk to this one as well. She's hard to persuade, I think. I don't think we've met before. Maria, hello. Nadia and Eleanor. It's a pleasure to meet you, Maria. Are you from the Chicago Rosalinis? That's right, yes. Oh, you must give my regards to Great Aunt Frances when you get back. I stayed with her last time I was out that way. She was very sweet to me. Like, really? Oh my god. I'm working on my masters out here. I'm from back east. The Giovannis have been nice enough to let me stay here while I finish up my studies. I've learned a great deal from them, like you wouldn't believe. Well, like what? I, um, I really can't say much about that. Uh-huh, why's that? Okay, we got two persuasion choices. That's a bit awkward. Two. Sure. There's something I want to show you, but you absolutely can't tell anyone. Even other people here, okay? Ah, oh, funny. Follow that. me. Cool. Come on. I'm coming, I'm coming. So this is one of the ways you can find out how to get in. So she shows you. Click. And it opens secret door. Come on. Pretty sure there's a guard down here, though. Oh, okay. If she disappears on me in the loading screen, I will be unimpressed, game. Very, very unimpressed. Or, you know, I could just wait, drink some Pepsi. Hmm. Not quite cream soda. Wow, well, everything's kind of spooky in here. Anyway, let me save it. I'll talk to you in a second. Okay, basically this will be the end of the set. Um, we've got a few things to do now. Um, we've got to pick up the book, which is around here somewhere. Aha! Your Giovanni book. Hello? If we talk to this... You know what they do in this room? No! What do they do? Um, I'd like to... <laughs> I know what I'd like to do in this room now we're alone. Um, it looks like an embalming room in a funeral park. Mm-hmm. Know what they do with the corpses? Have sex with... Uh, oh, please don't say sex. Um, <laughs> dress them up like Vikings, free them in ice and drop them in the ocean. No idea. I shouldn't do this, but... Why don't I show you? It gets pretty weird from here. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, and be ready to run. You'll understand when it happens. Follow me. Okay. Hey, lady, wait. They don't usually attack. Just don't provoke them. Uh huh. Wait for it. Yo, um. Zombie! What's happening? They're coming to get us. Gosh, we've got to get out of here. That's cool, you wait here. Okay, so things to do. Uh we can quick we need to um get the skill book that's down here. We got the thing for uh Pisha. Scary face he's a lady. And we've got to go get us a sarcophagus. Yay! Um doing this though I think cancels the party upstairs, which is the only sad thing. Um so we could have like abused that a little bit further. On the plus side, when we get back up, we can kill everybody. Or we can go back down and kill everybody. Whatever. Go up back now and do it. So yeah, thanks for watching. Um, so what do you want to do? We could continue down in zombie fest halls, go up, go up, and go back up and murder people. Which is fun and gets you experience. So you know, take your pick. Till then, thanks for watching. Bye.